Capability 14 of Public Health Emergency Preparedness, also called FEP, focuses on protecting the safety and health of those responding to an incident. In the event of a radiation emergency, Ohio first responders such as law enforcement and firefighters could potentially be exposed to dangerous levels of radiation. These emergencies may also expose the public to elevated levels of radiation. In addition, there is a potential for radioactive material to be spread from the incident site. This radioactive material could contaminate responders and members of the public, both internally and externally. The Ohio Department of Health Bureau of Environmental Health and Radiation Protection's Radiological Emergency Preparedness Program, also known as OREP, is committed to reducing radiation exposure to first responders and the public in the event of a radiation emergency. Emergency responders must quickly mobilize and manage any life-threatening injuries to victims. After these injuries are addressed, the incident commander, typically the local fire chief, will assess the scene and determine if the community is safe. Local hazmat teams will use manual radiation detectors to determine if any areas have dangerous radiation levels and if radioactive contamination is present. While performing these radiological surveys, responders will wear personal protective clothing, usually turnout gear, to protect themselves from radioactive contamination. However, there is no protective clothing for radiation exposure. Local Public Health and Unified Command will make protective action recommendations for the public in the vicinity of the incident. One of the actions may be to shelter in place until safe evacuation routes can be determined. This type of response is labor-intensive and time-consuming. In 2021, ODH partnered with the Ohio Department of Transportation's Unmanned Aircraft Systems, or UAS Center, to provide state-of-the-art radiation surveillance and situational awareness for first responders and other response partners during radiation incidents. The UAS Center provides expert experienced remote pilots and data mapping capabilities, while ODH provides health physics expertise in operating the radiation detection system payload and evaluating the radiation measurements. The UAS Center can also provide real-time video feeds of incidents to aid in situational awareness. The radiation detection capabilities of our unmanned aerial vehicle, or UAV, which we call DroneRAD, allows us to provide radiation exposure and radioactive contamination information without responders being exposed or contaminated. Additionally, when DroneRAD has an articulating camera attached, real-time video of the scene can be provided to incident command and others who can assess the situation. The drone rad accomplishes what responders would have to do without placing anyone in harm's way. One of our priorities is keeping emergency responders safe. The drone rad, with an additional camera, can quickly scan the scene of the incident for possible victims or hostile actors who may intend to do harm. At the same time, the UAV is performing visual surveillance of the scene, and the onboard radiation detectors are measuring and mapping radiation exposure. This information is mapped real-time and can be shared simultaneously to RAD Responder, an application used to share radiation data with federal and state radiological response partners to help local decision makers. Radiation exposure maps and safe work times in the radiation field can be generated and shared with Unified Command. This information is vital for Ohio responder safety. Another priority is to identify areas with elevated radioactive contamination. If radioactive material gets inside the body, it may lead to serious health consequences. The UAV can also access areas inaccessible to responders, either because of terrain or hazardous materials. This information may then be used to quickly map areas with radioactive contamination. This identifies households where people may have been contaminated and those people can be advised to seek additional assistance. Unified Command can use this information to limit access to certain areas and determine safe exit routes from the immediate area of the incident. An additional capability provided by DroneRad is the ability to search for radiation exposure devices, or REDs, and lost or stolen radioactive sources. Using a grid pattern, large or inaccessible areas can be scanned quickly for elevated radiation readings. The three detector payload can pinpoint a dangerous radiation exposure area without a responder being exposed. Using the same approach, 
suspicious containers can be checked for elevated radiation measurements. The authorities can identify dangerous areas and keep the public away. This innovative technology with the interagency cooperation between ODH and O.UAS gives Ohio a unique capability to help keep our responders safe and protect the health of Ohioans in the event of a radiation emergency. The Ohio Department of Health is committed to supporting local jurisdictions, especially local health departments, with responses to radiological incidents both large and small, like scrapyard and landfill alarms, as well as orphan sources discovered in the public domain.